When did you start suspecting that I was gay? I never did suspect you were gay. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Kainal, coming at you guys again this week with a brand new video. And today I am here with Kim from Nalo, my mom. So today we are answering gay questions. I convinced her to um, come in the video and answer questions about being gay. So the first question, I don't think you're gonna know it, but I'm gonna ask you anyways. What does LGBT mean? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Lesbian, gay, bisexual. What's the other two letters? LGB what? T. T. Times people. Yes. Yes, you're correct. Oh, I guessed it right. I didn't really <laughs> know what it meant. <laughs> Is being gay a choice? Do you think being gay is a choice? Yeah. Look, you're okay. asking me. I don't know. I'm just guessing. I don't know. Yes? No, but okay. This is it. I don't get the whole thing, okay? So <laughs> what don't do you take mean? it personal, people, because I don't know nothing. He's trying to educate me, okay? You really think it's a choice? Yeah. I don't know how to explain it. And I don't know how to understand it. So. Are you attracted to girls? No. <laughs> exactly. So it's not a choice. Duh, see? I just put it in the simplest I mean, question for you. No, that's a way to put it, but okay. <laughs> okay. Did you know that I was gay at a young age? No. She's in denial. Yes. <laughs> yes! <laughs> when did you start suspecting that I was gay? I never did suspect you were gay. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> what was it like for gay kids in your day and age? Uh -uh. <clears throat> when I was going to school, it was... I don't know, you, you could tell certain ones were. I know they weren't picked on. They would kick your ass. <laughs> they weren't more open to like how they were today. They didn't hold hands in front of everybody or like make out in front of everybody <laughs> like that. Your guys' generation, holy shit, you guys are just out there like no shame. And our generation is like kind of tough. Like they didn't really express it back then. Did you have any gay friends when you were younger and did you accept them? Yeah, I mean I had gay friends. I didn't think about that kind of stuff, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like it's psh, like, you know, <laughs> I just <laughs> see them as how they are, you know what I mean? <laughs> so... Do you have more gay friends or more lesbian friends? Lesbian friends. You have more lesbian friends? I'm not really religious, but my mom is religious, so this question is for her. Do you think I'm going to hell? <laughs> <laughs> I see. I say, I say yes. I want to say yes, but then I want to say no. He's saying he's gay, so that's where he's gonna, you know, I think he's gonna go to hell. But then, I'm kind of still in denial and I don't think he's gay, so I think not. I think God accepts all everybody, so... What was the hardest part for you to process about me being gay? You being gay? <laughs> I guess because you're my firstborn. Second of all is because... I really don't think you're gay, and I blame my sisters. In correlation to her blaming her sisters, this next question is for that statement. Um, do you think that me being gay was influenced? When he was a little baby, my sister them would freaking dress him up in my like nightgown and make him wear heels and put makeup on him. I can run in heels. Oh my god. <laughs> um, like, do shit like that to him and then I'll come home from work and be like, oh, doesn't he look cute? Oh, but then if I try to on their kids, oh, they get all mad. He makes sixth grade, he used to hang out with this girl. She was the first girl that I met that was into girls. My mom thinks that because she was gay, she influenced me to be gay. This is what I think and I heard, but I heard from she, <laughs> she, they used to watch dirty videos. And then I think I her, watch porn all the time now. And then I think her cousin was gay or something, and then she was trying to set up my son with her cousin or something. And she started showing him like, all these gay videos and shit like that. I think that's how she start. He started watching porn and crap. That's when he I, started watching and porn. I think that's when it started. <laughs> and all this shit, gay shit started and stuff like that. Then, so that was sixth grade going into seventh grade. Then he started going to intermediate. He started hanging out with other kids, and then I think. Yeah, that kid was gay, and then all this gay stuff started, and then that girl, and then all this stuff <laughs> came out, and I was like, what the hell? Like, they were out there. They brainwashed you. That's, that, 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 that's not how it works. That's not how it works, because... Well, that's how I seen it. Do you see it that way now? <laughs> no, it's all different now, because, you know, we got you away from the groups, you know, because you seemed like you was going a little distraught a little bit, like, you know, you have to find yourself, whatever. So after he left school, 
and you got out into the real world. Yeah. Surprise, I still like guys. <laughs> you got into the real world, right? And you grew up a little. You seem happier, like you found yourself, whatever. And that's what I want. I want you to be happy. So you seem like you got your shit together now. And you're a lot older, so you know, I don't know if you're still gay or not, if you are okay, but I guess because you're older now and it's giving you time to process and learn a little bit more on how you feel and... Have you come to terms with me being gay? I think so. <laughs> it's better okay, than a no. Okay, wait, wait, wait. right now I, I seem okay about it. Because I'm single? Yeah, I guess. Are you comfortable with talking about me being gay? Like saying you're gay? I haven't said it yet. <laughs> <sighs> what was the question again? All this pressure about being <laughs> gay. So, I don't know. I, I guess because right now I he's single, so I haven't experienced him being with someone yet. So, I guess when it gets to that point and I accept it, then I'll be like, My son is gay! <laughs> my son is gay! <laughs> my gay son! <laughs> if I started dating someone, would you like to meet him? Of course. If I did start dating someone, she would want me to introduce him as a friend first before um, a love interest. Why do you have to say like love interest? <laughs> like what would happen if I just bring up a guy? I'm like, oh mom, this is my boyfriend. Um, <laughs> you might have a different reaction than you might want. Just put it that way, because I really you can't be dropping the bomb on me like that. <laughs> I haven't, you know. It's not. Is it necessarily like him being a guy, or is it just necessarily the vibes of the person? I think it's both. If I had a wedding, would you come? Yeah. Of I course. mean, obviously at that point, I feel like you'd already kind of be in. Better. Yeah. Have known the person by then. You get married without me knowing this person, then you'll know, have another thing coming. I wouldn't put it past him because, you know, he does shit like that. What? <laughs> Is there anything that scares you about me being gay? Like, do you have any fears about me being gay? Only you catching diseases. Anyways, guys, that was my video for today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and oh, click, uh, click the subscribe button if you guys haven't already. Thank Holy you. Holy shit. And I'll see you guys later. Yep. This is Kim from Nalo. Hope it helps you guys. <laughs>